Uh, Meyer's going to be six men of the year, I'm just guessing. So, so far I've predicted two championships in a row, and even before that, the season before I started winning championships, I also predicted that I'd get to the finals, but I also predicted that I wouldn't even win that final, I'm pretty sure. I could go back to the audio, or you could go back to the footage, I don't care. But it looks like this is the first year I'm uh, ranked first in the power rankings, so that's really good. Um, predictions for this year, uh, obviously another championship. My team has only gotten better. As long as everybody doesn't get to uh, fold themselves, I think we'll be in good shape. So thus begins season six of Road to Nine. And uh, let's see. Uh, these are probably important decisions to make now. Because they might not be happy with me later. There's no reason I shouldn't sign this man right now. He's good. And he's only going to get better. He's a 95 at age 26. Uh, he should only get better, honestly. I'm going to just do player. And for guys like this, for example, um, you, you don't need to worry about, like, try and offer them as low as you can. Because, uh, quite honestly, uh, they can't go anywhere. And it's not like they get angry at you. See, look, I, I signed him for a lot less than I should have. He's worth 20 million a year. Like, I can't... Oh, man. I can't let him go, but at the same time, I don't want to sign up for that long either. That's better. He's worth 20 million a year. That's just fucking ridiculous, but it's worth it. He's a good player. I like him a lot. Worst case scenario, I just trade him. Like, honestly, I, I, it's just that simple. So I've got him for another four years plus a player option. Awesome. I've just... I've just sealed up a majority of my problems in terms of re-signing contracts and such. So hopefully nobody gets angry that about the roles and such, and uh, the chemistry should say should stay relatively good. If I see it start to decline, I'm going to make some adjustments. But um, right now we're ten and zero, so I, I have nothing to complain about at the moment. And as soon as I say that uh, shit starts happening, like we lose and uh, chemistry starts decreasing. But um, you tend to take hits in your chemistry when you lose a game, but uh, if you see you if you see your chemistry dip below a ninety, um, there's something wrong. I mean, even if your chemistry's high enough, uh, there's just something wrong. Even if you've lost a few games in a row, if your if your chemistry is just steadily decreasing like it is right now, I'm gonna see what's wrong. And something's wrong. Somebody's really not happy. And that's exactly who I expected to be angry. Wow, him too? Fuck. Um, I can't afford to get rid of Washburn. I really just can't. He's gonna have to be... Boozer, you fucking asshole. Yeah, I, I knew I was gonna trade you, Boozer. You know why I knew that? Because I traded you last time. And the same fucking shit happened. I just need a power forward that's not gonna be pissy with me. That guy looks perfect. Um, but I want somebody with cheaper. Oh, it's cheaper, excuse me. Pardon my English. Let's give you back to the Bulls, fuck it. I don't even care, this is just morals. <laughs> Let the computer adjust that shit. Kendrick Perkins is now gonna be playing, so uh, he should be slightly happier than uh, normal. With his angry ass face. These two, I don't know what the fuck to tell them. Like, Meyer is Meyer. I, I can't do anything about Meyer. I need him to back me up with power forward. This guy, on the other hand, he's 22 years old. Like, the fuck does he want? I know he's an 84 right now, but, uh,. He really needs to suck it up here. Uh, you know, he's got like the second most minutes out of the non-starters. Like, you really gotta just suck it up for a second. Like, come on. Just 
making him a role player make him feel better? Like, the fuck do you want? Like, you know what? I don't even give a shit. Just suck it up. If by the trade deadline he's still disappointed, I might trade him. I don't know. Alright, looked like Boozer was the major problem. And, uh, it looks like, uh, everybody's... Oh, shit. That loss just crushed my team. <laughs> oh, my God. That lo Oh, man. My Washburn's hurt, so that's good. Because now he's not going to be pissed off at anybody. Because he's hurt. And he shouldn't give a shit. Alright, so chemistry is about 88. So, let's see if I could fix that somewhere along the lines here. Ain't nobody fresh your army. Alright, Stevens is better than Meyer because Meyer is pissed off. Uh, this is bad. Because, uh, it just is. Fuck. He was perfectly fine with being a six man when I fucking signed him. Like, what's wrong with him? I suppose I could get rid of Perkins. And maybe, just maybe. Um, let me see the coaching right now, because uh, Perkins should be getting no minutes, and uh, I should be giving Washburn all the minutes I can. I, like, none of my other prospects are angry. That's what's blowing my mind right now. Well, not none. I mean, Stevens is angry, which is respectable because, uh, Guess what? Uh, you're good, but you're not that good. I know that Stevens is going to be my point guard of the future. Uh, not my point guard, my small forward of the future. Like, Stevens is good now. And uh, in a few years, he's going to be great. I know that for a fact. Same with Washburn. Washburn is going to start, like, very soon. What do I get for Washburn if I trade him? I don't want to trade him, but I don't want a man who's frustrated with being on this team because he's just going to drag the rest of the team down. Oh, wow, Josh Smith. A 90 point guard to 25? Jesus. That's not that great. Royce White is showing up in my face for whatever reason. It's not worth it to trade you. Um. Wow, this is tough because I could get rid of Lawson, who I actually like, and have Washburn start, which wouldn't be better, but it would be good because um, he could do that, but I just can't do that. Um, let me see if we can get a power forward here. Fucking speakers in the way of my mid-level uh, remaining. Yep, that figures. Don't shut up. I'm just, I, I can't make any of these trades. I know these guys don't want to be on my team, but they gotta suck it up. And that's really bad for my team overall because uh, they're just gonna get worse because the team's gonna be unhappy as a whole. But I think uh, if I gave, since I gave uh, Washburn some more minutes, uh, I should be alright. Uh, maybe, let's see, Green is the shooting guard, so I need him to keep those minutes, but, uh, everybody else should be fine. Alright, I think we'll be fine. I think Meyer can suck it up a little bit, and, uh, we'll be alright. I hope. I just, I need them to keep it above a 70, at least, before we hit the playoffs. And Lawson has broken his finger, but he'll be able to play through it. Um, no. The reason I say no to this is because A, we're doing fucking amazing, and B, uh, it'll give this guy time to cool the fuck off. Because he's pissed for whatever goddamn reason. So I'll give him time to cool off, and maybe I'll be able to increase my chemistry because of it. Oh fucking hey, we're just losing now? Fuck. Okay, we're winning. This is ah oh, shit. Why are we losing? Okay, 
this is good. That broken finger actually helped perfectly because uh, that gave uh, Meyer time to start. And uh, I don't want to piss off Lawson though, so I'm gonna have to switch it back. Fuck, we lost. Uh, uh, Meyer just got hurt, so that's actually pretty good because uh, he's being a bitch. And we let the league in points per game. Had a player in the defensive first team, blah, blah, blah. You can read it if you want. I don't really give a shit about any of this. Except for coaching the MVP, which is DeMarcus Cousins. There we go. I was kind of expecting Brandon Jennings for some reason. I guess because he had such a good year the other year. Warren Barnes. Um, that's the point guard that I drafted. <laughs> well, it's only good that he got most improved because he barely played last year. So that makes fucking sense when he's got 16 points a game, so holy shit. And, uh, my coach doesn't get coach of the year even though, uh, oh, I'm sorry I didn't look through all that, but I don't really don't give a shit. So. If you guys really want to see it, um, I may as well put it up real quick. The rookies really shouldn't matter because, uh, you don't know them, so, you know, whatever. Anyway. I mean, I guess you could look back and see a rookie who made the first team and be like, Oh, look at that. Hey, look at that, actually. I get to play Carlos Boozer. You wreck his shit. Uh, let me just check my coaching because I want to make sure all that's solid. Uh, he's hurt, but he can still play, but uh, he'll be alright. Everything else is pretty much solid. Yeah, this is good. So I'm pretty much going to sim through this. Uh, unless there's a decisive game, or there's a game where it's game seven or some shit like that. But, as good as my team is right now, I don't see that happening. Just have the computer adjust that shit. Uh, have the computer adjust it? That's, nah. <laughs> okay, have the computer adjust it. Oh, wow. Kendrick Perkins getting hurt actually had an effect? No, it didn't. No one gave a shit that day. I hate this song, but whatever. Um, I don't see myself losing another game. I really just don't. And there's another one lost, so, uh, oh shit, okay? I gotta check something, because we are losing games, and I'm not good with that. Fucking A, Jesus. This just pisses me off. People... Fuck. I hate this song, too. It's stupid. I can hear you, shut up! I fucking hate you. You would think these guys would want to sign with me, just for cheap, because, um, guess what? You're about to win a fucking championship. What the hell is wrong with you? But, people are stupid. Oh, the fucking speaker. I swear I hate it, you guys. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. How about this guy? David West. Okay, there we go. Smart man. Anyway. Uh, if Kendrick Perkins is hurt, I really just don't want him playing, because he's not good to begin with. And playing hurt, he might just be stupid. So, definitely don't want that. If he's angry right now, then fuck him. Like, I'd rather have a better player uh, get the minutes he has, so... He's gonna be my sixth man, so I don't fucking lose. It's obvious because he's mad that I'm losing these games because when he gets hurt, the next six man is going to be, um, what's his face? So Perkins is, uh, just leave the rotation as is. And Campbell just separated his shoulder, which the guy I just subbed in, so I'm going to just let the computer handle that. And, uh, I'm going to look at it now. Um... So, as soon as I put in the guy to be the new six-man, he gets his ass hurt. So that's just fucking great. Uh, I guess I'll have Harrison take over. Because he's better. Right now. Mr. Angry Bitch over here. Um, I realize it's funny because I, it kind of reminds me of Angry Bitch or whatever. But anyway. Uh, I'm going to switch that up a bit. And uh, hopefully we win this game, otherwise uh, I'm going to play the game out and see who, was, who the fuck is on this team, for one thing. 
Oh, Beal and John Wall, the guy I tried to sign the other day. The other day. <laughs> a couple seasons ago. And this guy, I don't know who that is, but he had a good game. Okay, they don't have, they don't even have a fucking good team. Derrick Rose, they got Marcus Saul for whatever fucking reason. They got Mr. Syracuse and shitty players. Just all shitty. Oh, wow. Pow and Mark are on the same fucking team. That's, that's just adorable. And they got destroyed. Anyway. There we go. Okay, so now I don't have to go into the game. So that's fantastic. And it looks like the Timberwolves are actually going to get back to the championship as of right this second. Um, fuck. Dwight Howard was on the Rockets and they still lost. So they got Ricky Rubio, Derek Williams, uh, DeRozan still uh, fucking shit up, and uh, Kevin Love. Holy shit. This man is fucking amazing. Oh no. I don't want to see this team in the final. I just don't. Oh my god. So who is on the 76ers? I'm about to find out when I lose the first game. Uh, let's see. Evan Turner. Good player. Not so good. Not so good either. Not that great. And Andrew Bynum. So basically a team oh wait, no, excuse me, true holiday. So three stars against three stars. So this is pretty much as equal as it's gonna get. So I might have to play these games out if I lose this game right here, which I just did, so um This is gonna be one of the long seasons, so um if you want to see the game, uh Timberwolves made it to the playoffs, no shit. They got a better team than I do. But anyway, if you want to see Game 5, just click this annotation that's hovering over uh, the glowing square. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, so we won Game 5. Uh, still got a long way to go if we want to win and get to the finals and face off against um, a very dangerous Timberwolves team. But anyway. If you want to go see game six, just click on the annotation over the glowing box, and uh, otherwise just wait a few seconds and you'll see uh, the outcome. Alright, so um, if you didn't tell, if you couldn't tell, uh, game seven has been forced. So um, if you want to go to the video, uh, just click the annotation that's over the glowing box. If you don't want to watch it, just wait a few seconds and uh, the video will continue on and we'll have the results of Game 7. Alright, so Game 7, we dominated. Uh, it was just a terrible game for the 76ers. And uh, we just dominated. So now it's Game 1 of the Finals. Uh, this team scares the shit out of me. But we just won. I don't know how. What the hell? Well, we won by four, so it's not like we, de we beat them a lot. Derek Williams is going to be a huge component. So is Kevin Love. I think Brandon Jennings will be able to shut down Rubio. But my power forward against their power forward is just, is just not going to work. Uh, Roland Campbell is healed from his injury. Oh my god, yes. That's awesome. That is really awesome. I'm just going to leave it as is because if it ain't broke, don't fix it. You know what I mean? Uh, we're winning, so this is good. How the fuck? That was, wow, that was really anticlimactic. Because if you look at this team, if you look at this Timberwolves team right here, they've got Rubio, they got Derek Williams and Kevin Love. Oh, ooh, that's why I won, right there, that is why I won, The Rosen got hurt, I mean granted he's not the best player on the team, he's probably the most aggressive though, that's probably why they lost, uh, oh wow, Meir went off, jeez, Meyer went off, holy shit, so did Cousins, he had a great game, so did Jennings, he even dished out some assists, he almost had a triple-double, Forte had a decent game, and the rest of them, everybody had a, a decent game, or an okay game, honestly, it wasn't great. Barnes, for example, eh, he was good on the boards, at least. 
And then on the other side, Derek Williams tried, but missing 11 shots probably cost him. Kevin Love missed a lot of shots. Oh my god. He's just falling apart. Fred Ed made a few shots, a few three pointers. A lot of free three pointers were made. Holy shit. Let's see. So they made about 15 three pointers, which is a lot more than I could say for my team. Uh, we only made 10. And uh, most, if not all of them, were made by Meyer. Hello? He can't make those in game. I don't know why he was able to make them there. But anyway, that ends season six. Um, we have three in a row. DeMarcus Cousins is the finals MVP. How Gasol, Devin Harris, Tony Parker, and Nene are going to retire. I'm pretty sure Tony and Powell are going to get Hall of Fame uh, ballots. Or not. That was weird. Okay. Um, anyway, that's that. So that's the end of Season 6. That's three championships. I've got... Let me do my math. Six more to go. So until next time, see ya.